start. Eh, maybe. Maybe we're getting ready to start. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Gathering Hall episode 277. Freedom Planet 2, Part 1. I've been waiting for this game to come out for literally years. Since I played the original back in like 2018. Get ready to kick some butt. Alright, let's let's kick some butt, shall we? Uh, Alright, so we start off with four characters right off the bat to choose from. But uh, as this is... You know, she's the main character. We've got to play as Lilac. Oh, hold on, hold on. Ooh, Mila was by far my least favorite character to play as in the first one. Um, but yeah, we'll stick we'll stick with Lilac for now. And we'll do normal. Would you like to play a brief tutorial? Yes, please. Would not be a bad idea. Okay, so... Blink dash. Ooh, fancy. And yeah, you can do that in any direction. I do remember that. Let's climb. How far can we get? Ah, the whole way to the top. Ah, the pixel art is so nice. I don't think there's going to be any secrets at the beginning, so we're not even going to worry about it. Nice. I like special move. A speed dragon boost using this technique requires energy to meter total level, which regenerates as you collect crystals. Okay. Got it. Oh god, we've taken damage in the tutorial. <laughs> oh no. I hate these bushes. Murder the bushes, dude. Okay, so she ricochets off walls too. Nice. The, uh, the attack you get when pressing the attack one depends on which direction you're holding. Oh! Nice! Alright, so I can do a cool uppercut. Can I do a cool uppercut in the air? Yes, yes I can! It almost acts as a... So, can I uppercut and then... No, I can't. Ugh. Oh. Nice. God, I love the pixel art. It looks so nice. Okay, so I'm guessing... Yeah, that's pretty cool. Travel up slopes, keep... So, yeah, it works just like Sonic. Sweet. That was fun. Oh no! 
It's Frieza. <laughs> it looks like Frieza. Sorry. A very angry Frieza. Three years later. It's my robot, Carol. Do I get to race Carol? That'd be pretty neato. Oh. Oh, that... I saw something. Is that... Yep. Dang it. I still see something. Oh. It's just a, a bunch of gems. Ah, the music sounds like it's going to be really good, too. I do kind of wish she didn't say Cyclone every time I double jumped. <laughs> Admittedly, kind of obnoxious. I guess it's not every time, but it's frequent enough that it's kind of annoying. Kill the giant thing. Okay, I do get more height from the uppercut than I do the double jump. But I get more hang time from the double jump. It's an axe thing. <laughs> What's up, big yellow? What's the yellow gem do? Oh, neat. I don't know what this does. What am I doing? I'm not quite sure what the. Okay. Maybe, like, a distance traveled, I would have gotten more. That's kind of what it looked like. That's what I'm guessing. Oh! I got a shield, potentially? Use the air currents. Can I just do that a whole bunch? I totally can. Oh, God. I like the dragon dash thing. That's pretty neat. For a second, I thought maybe I had soft locked it. <laughs> Duck. God. Where'd he go? No, come back. I want to murder you. Maybe I can't? Things are kind of scary, dude. Cyclone. 
Oh, grab that rope or whatever it's supposed to be. So it looks like if, if I have full health and I get health, it just gives me gems instead. Oh god. You found a brave stone. Oh. Did I? Oh no, my little green thing died. I guess I, I don't know or not if there is contact damage, but oh, that thing looks cool. The thing with all these uh, gems growing out of it. That, yeah, that's a very Sonic esque uh, mechanic. Oh! ladder please We got a checkpoint. And we's going fast, boy! Oh, we're being chased by the dude. Suck it, nerd! Cyclone. Ow. Oh god! Oh, he's beating the snot out of me, dude! It's so fast. Done. Dragon boost finished. Ooh. I got a card. Control. 
I'm running myself ragged chasing after them all. Pshaw! Those things don't stand a chance against world saving pros like us. Yeah, I guess, but it does take weeks to fix. Months, even. Hmm. Well, why don't we just stay at Mila's for now? <laughs> she runs a lab, not a bed and breakfast. But still, maybe she'd know what to do. Oh, that's the basic. Oh, so we got like a world map, too. Shining Water Temple Hub. Sure. We have items. Hmm. Well, I don't, but it looks like I can get items. Cyclone! Cyclone! I'm wondering if, uh... I was kind of hoping I could turn the in-game voice off, but I don't want the voice. Uh, photograph. I mean, I've literally never seen... <laughs> That's pretty interesting. All right. place tonight our house was destroyed by this giant robot and we need a place to stay while we fix this i the... brought snacks please come right in me laboratorio and you laboratorio uh what oh uh never mind just don't touch anything that's glowing or moving or glowing okay No, oh, dude, she beat the crap out of me last time I played this game. Tenku Horizon, hello, dude. Welcome to the stream. A very lonely stream tonight. It's a late night stream, though, so it's not surprising. And yes, it, it was indeed Spanish. She occasionally breaks into Spanish. I don't know why. I think she did that in the first game, too. We're safer discussing this at the palace. Come. Well, Thank what you. if we don't wanna? You did kind of crash our unscripted sleepover. <laughs> it would be unwise of you to refuse. Right, we're going. You go, what are you? Okay, okay easy. You heard the lady. Touch the okay, hold on a sec. Make that two reports. What is this creepy ass robot? Mila is really attached to the stump for some reason. She calls him Mr. Stumpy. Okay. Cyclone. Uh, what are we going to do before the next day? I have no idea. I don't know what, what I'm doing. Uh, I literally just completed the first stage in the tutorial. We are still at the very, very beginning of the game. Hello, little person! I'm the local merchant around these parts. I sell a couple of helpful items that tone down the difficulty for new adventurers. Losing helpful items reduces the crystal bonus you receive at the end of the stage, so I would suggest you only use them if you need them. Okay, well, I don't I don't super feel like I needed help in the last stage. Again, though, it was the first stage, so maybe things will get more difficult as we progress. That's a cool looking bird, dude. Juniper, hello. Friend of Hound. Friend is traveling. We have items very strong. Rabbit speaks of them. No rooms here. You can sleep in Hound Tree. <laughs> Safe travels. All right, bro. That's cool. 
Yeah, dude, I love the artwork for this game. It looks so nice. Alright, I guess we're, uh, well, we're not. I get called in every month to patch things up around here. This place is literally falling apart. I bring this little guy with me when I'm mining for gems. Earth orbs make nearby crystals drift between... Okay, so it's like a, it's a magnet. No, I was I, I did not press up. I pressed to the left. I guess. Yeah, to the left, maybe. You will travel to Shenzhou Palace and meet with the... You will act with proper reverence. I will not tolerate any flippancy. No, <laughs> no flippancy from you. Dragon Valley. Okay, this is where we gotta go, I guess. Chenlin Park. Is this an actual stage? It appears to be. Oh! I mean, that was pretty neat. I kind of wanted to look around in that underwater area, though. Let me do that. Uh, okay, there we go. Or not. <laughs> I guess I am forbidden. Ah! Oh, the swimming is weird, dude. Okay, I guess they have ear pieces or something. I'm not quite sure what that was all about. Can I ring the bell? Yeah, I totally can. Awesome. The game gets points for me for, uh, ah! I was able to do so by carefully na uh, get the navigation to get the fire orb. What's the fire orb? It's gonna take me a minute to get used to the controls, I think. Ah, oh, there's actually like people on the train. That's pretty cool. Down here we go. I'm assuming the train is just background decoration and it's not going to actually damage me. Point obtained. Oh, we actually have an oxygen meter too. Okay. So, yeah, that's weird. Hmm. You finished Lilac Story? Yeah, I'd pre prefer not to have the game spoiled. That's a really big bird, dude. I hadn't even realized the game came out. I just so happened to be looking on Steam and saw that it was out and I was excited. You know, because the first game was really good. It had issues, um, but otherwise, for the most part, I really, really enjoyed it. Give me stuff, Bell. Okay, fine. Fine. 
Oh, I'm actually kind of lost. Oh, those explosions hurt me. I'm assuming... Hey, look, there's the guy. I want to go up the tube. Oh, I can also run across the water, I guess. Very Sonic-like. Which isn't surprising, if I remember correctly, the original game was literally supposed to be like a, a ROM hack of a Sonic game. Giant bird. Oh, here we go. You forgot your shield. That's okay. I'm too good for shields. We all know this is a lie. <laughs> Do I want to go down here? Oh, I can't. Can I? I want to try something. Come train. Yeah! That's really neat. I'm glad it doesn't damage me, because I totally thought it was going to. I hate the little cars. are the worst. <laughs> Ow. Ow. I guess that was my fault. I like that it gives you like a ha ha face. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Give me all the gems. weird that was also kind of weird is it gonna be the giant bird I bet it's the giant bird okay okay hold on where's the bird head Come here, bird's head. Oh, yeah, I had a lot of issues with the bosses in the first game, so I'm not expecting it to be any different with this one. Bucket bird! Do take note of the boss's weakness if you want to hit the weapon itself. Yeah, that seems to work. Let's do that, shall we? Where'd he go? Oh, we're just turning around. Ooh, I don't want to be down there. 
Ow. Stupid tube! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I like how it was like <laughs> nice. That was fun. Yeah. <laughs> Did you guys see my sweet moves? No, actually I didn't, Carol. So are each of the characters going to have different, like, levels to play through? Because that would be pretty sick. 